forecast like that, it means it may be the perfect time to catch an outdoor movie. And you don't have to look any farther than Muskegon for the 16th annual Movies on the Dock. Joining us right now to talk more about this, John Stevenson. He's one of the this year's organizers of the event. Good morning, John. Thanks so much for being with us. Good morning. Thank you for having me. Well, so tell us all about this. What is Movies on the Dock all about? Well, Movies on Deck takes place on USS LST-393, which is a historic warship on the Muskegon waterfront at the Mark Dock. Uh, it's a uh, World War II ship, and it will be 80 years old on uh, Veterans Day this year. It was in three invasions during World War II, Sicily, Italy, and Omaha Beach. He was there on D-Day. Uh, we, the, it's a 333-foot long freighter, and the top deck is really big and really long, and we've suspended a huge screen on top, and we show movies like a drive-in on Friday nights during the summer. The first one is coming up this Friday. It's uh, Flying Leathernecks. And the uh, admission is free. Doesn't cost anything to come and watch it. And we sell popcorn and pop and candy. Uh, and the movies start when it gets dark at uh, 10 o'clock, but you can come a little earlier and watch one of the nicest sunsets you'll ever see over Muskegon Lake. Wow, what a cool experience this is. I love this and it's completely free. What else do people need to know? Like if can they bring blankets and things like that? Like what should they be prepared for? Right, they should bring chairs and they should watch the weather and bring, <laughs> if it's gonna be cool, uh, remember that the movies end at midnight. So uh, you might wanna bring a jacket or a sweater um, also, we show the movies rain or shine. Now, if it rains, we'll go inside the ship because we have a giant screen inside too. Uh, inclement weather doesn't mean that the movies are off, uh, but we'll show all four movies, rain or shine, and, uh, but for sure bring something to sit on, uh, a chair or a blanket, something like that. Okay, wow. And so can people tour, take a tour of the ship before the movie? Is there any chance, to, opportunities to do that? You can walk around the top deck and see what's on the outside of the ship, but the volunteers, and we're an all volunteer museum, the volunteers are busy selling popcorn, setting up the movie, and we don't have time to supervise <laughs> the inside of the ship. But you do get a chance to see what's on the top deck and the uh, upper decks on the outside. Wow, what a unique, cool experience. If people want to learn more about this, they want to get information, the dates and times and things, what do they need to know? Uh, the, one of the best places to find out information about LST-393 and the museum is at lst393.org. That tells all the times and when we're open, we're open six days a week, Tuesday through Sunday, 10 o'clock in the morning until five o'clock at night, but the last ticket is sold at four o'clock. Okay. Um, and uh, that gives you all the information, both about the movies and the dates. We're, we're gonna have Iron Man on July 8th and uh, who framed Roger Rabbit on July 22nd and Ferris Bueller's day off on August 5th. And um, all that information is on the website, lst393.org. Wonderful. John, thank you so much for taking the time to chat with us today. What I just love that you're doing this. What a cool thing to do. Well, thank you for having me and see you at the movies. Sounds good. All right. It's a